Okay, guys. Um, welcome to day 320, uh, my week in review. Now, my weeks have been a little bit different. I've been doing a lot of different body paintings. Um, I've come up with a style that I like that I'm going to be creating uh, 10 more pieces with. And um, it's an organic kind of style. Um, let me just, I'm not going to do any tutorials today. I'm just going to sit here and talk to you and let you know about a couple things that are coming up in this next year. And I know uh, I still got at least 45 more days to go before the end of the year. But let me just uh, relay some of this information to you. Um, so, my whole thing is, I'm going to be doing a few things next year. I'm going to be going to a lot of conventions to network, to build myself, to, you know, really push my whole body art that I want to do and everything else like that. Um, you can find me on Model Mayhem. That's where I have a lot of my um, other photos that I can't post on Facebook and they're really good. And I'll post that link down below in the blog and you can see it there. Now, um, a couple things are uh, next year, February 9th through the 12th, is Capital Kidvention in Washington, D.C. Now, last year, or this past year, um, I went and they had a little competition with some groups and I gained free registration to it. I've already registered a hotel room. It's now at the new uh, Ronald Reagan Hotel. And it's supposed to be a lot better. It's right closer to Washington, D.C. And um, I'm going to be going there and more than likely I'm going to be driving up there with my friend Joseph Young. Now, he's a magician and he wanted to go because he heard about Capital Convention and how great it was for all kinds of children's entertainment. Okay? I was going to be doing some stops along the way, but because I have my friend with me, I'm not. So... The next convention I'm doing after that, and this is a real big thing for me, I'm giving up a gig that's at the same time to go to this convention because I feel it's going to benefit me more than going to this place that I've been going to for years to make money. Um, I'm going to be going to La Fette. In New Orleans and that's May 14th through the 17th I think um, real quick let me check it up here on my computer and uh, if you need to see it I'll post the link down below and it's www.lafee -E, or I'm sorry www.lafete.us and you go there, and it is March 14th through 17th of uh, 2012. So, um, along with that, and let me close that out. I have a map up here. Uh, the reason I do that is so I can see how long it's going to take me to get to a certain place. Now, I am going by myself, but... I'm not flying there. I'm driving. The reason is because I have my computer that I use for all my photo shoots and everything. It's my HP Touch Smart, so I take it with me wherever I go. I have my camera. I have my backdrop system. I have my lighting. I, do, I bring all that with me because you never know when you can use it at any area that you're in. So, looking at my map and leaving from my location, okay? I'm going to be leaving from the Tri-Cities area, uh, King, Kingsport, Johnson City, Bristol, Virginia, Tennessee area, okay? I'm heading over to Livingston, Texas to meet up with a friend from Facebook. I don't, I have lots of friends around this area, but I don't have a lot of face painting friends, okay? Most of mine live out of town and stuff, and I meet them either at conventions or at certain festivals that I go to and stuff like that. But the one thing is, she has a great interest in this. She likes what I do. So I gave her the option to um, travel with me to New Orleans. 
I'll go to Livingston, Texas. I'll pick her up. We'll go to, you know, New Orleans. We'll go to Lafette. We'll have a great time there. And then I'll take her home, and then I'll head home. But on the way there is a 16-hour drive for me. So I want to know if anybody is interested in hosting me for a night, you know, so I don't have to pay hotel cost. <laughs> now with this, it entails a little bit of a free class, you know, pick my brain for whatever you want and stuff like that. Now my route that I'm taking will take me through Knoxville, Cleveland, Tennessee, Chattanooga, and then I'll be heading into Alabama where I'll be hitting Gadsden, Birmingham, um, Tuscaloosa. I'll be going right into Mississippi where I'll be hitting Meridian, Jackson, Vicksburg. I have a friend in Shreveport. If he's watching this video, if you want me to stop by and say hi, give me a shout. I will come by and visit you. Okay? Then I'll be heading down into Texas area and stuff. And, you know, what is that? Uh, Lufkin and uh, Huntsville, Texas and stuff. So, if you want me to stop by your place and you want me to, you want to pick my brain for what I know and stuff and... You want to just have a paint jam or something like that, let me know. If you want, I also give workshops. If you host the workshop, you will get to take it for free. I just require that everybody else, up to six more people, $75 a person. Okay? I don't want to overload the class. I don't want it to be overloaded at all. So the thing is... Um, if you want to take a workshop with me, contact me. It's $75 a person for up to six more people besides the host. Uh, if the host uh, supplies a place for me to stay and a place for me to do this workshop, then they'll get the workshop for free. All right. So I'm taking this trip all the way from my place in Bristol, Virginia to Livingston, Texas. Okay. You can Google it. It'll show you the exact route that I'm going to be taking. So if you live in one of those areas and you would like me to do a workshop or you would just like to pick my brain and host me for a night so that I don't have to pay hotel costs, that's great. Um, afterwards, same thing. I got to head home. You know, I'm going to go through these areas again. Maybe I'll take a different route from uh, New Orleans to... Uh, my place or actually no I gotta go back to Livingston so I guess it's gonna be the same route but I will have more time after that so if you want me to come into your area and I'm not gonna take that route just let me know okay um, the same thing when it comes down to Fabiac okay the face and body art international convention they are now holding it in uh, Fort Lauderdale Florida really nice you need to go to the website F-A-B-A-I-C dot com. Mm, excuse me. And you need to check out this new hotel and everything else. It's closer to Davie, Florida, which is where Silly Farm is. And it makes it easier for them because when they do these Faba TV classes and everything, they don't have to go as far as they did from Orlando to Davie, Florida. So now they're a lot closer to where they're at. They can do a lot more things, and I think it's going to be beneficial for them. Yes, I know it is farther, but it is a lot better, and unlike last year, you don't have to worry about people breaking into your cars. You don't have to worry about, you know, the way the hotel handles things. You do have free internet. You do have free parking. You don't have to. <laughs> a lot of things. <coughs> mm, excuse me. So that's pretty much what I'm doing next year. There are a few things that I'm doing locally, festivals and everything else like that. But the one thing I want to let you know is I will be traveling around quite a bit. In fact, also next year I will be going up to Toronto, Canada to meet with Natasha Kudashkina. Um, she is a wonderful, awesome body painter. She's worked with um, Lauren Alice. I think, yes, Lauren Alice. Um, and she has a lot of work in ML Gallery 
and uh, she did a few things along with her and you know collaborations and stuff like that. I'm going up because you noticed up here on my wall uh, in other videos right back up here I have plenty of pictures of body paintings that I have done um, that I have had done on me okay so this whole wall up here is all photos of me painted by other artists and one of the things is I really love Natasha's um, line work her detail her colors and everything like that and she loves cats too so I asked her you know and we're talking about this how much would it cost you know to paint me up as a cat and stuff in her style and I want to get some really professional photos done and get them up on my wall so uh, we're gonna do that and I'm gonna work out getting up to Toronto Canada so of course when that time comes I'll put out another video or um, I'll put out another uh, little statement if you want to do a workshop or something let me know I'm gonna be driving all the way up there so you know things will happen I also have another friend Shannon Nicole who lives all the way over in Los Angeles California who I'm gonna go visit in the springtime too and I will be traveling all the way out that way by car um, so I'll be able to stop off at different people's you know places do workshops it's sort of like a mini tour because I'm gonna be doing a lot of this traveling but it's a great way of networking and really being able to pick my brain and stuff like that so I'll give you some more information on that as time you know rolls on the other thing I'm thinking about doing and it probably won't be until sometime in the summer is actually going over to the Netherlands to visit Diamond Effects okay um, as you know at the beginning of the year they sponsored me there's been a lot of problems this way and that way and everything else everything's been resolved who cares all right Diamond Effects is still a great product I just haven't been able to get it lately and at the time with all the uh, white being gone and stuff like that I did switch over to tag which I don't have a problem with it's you know but the thing is I want to go back to using all different kinds of products I don't use just one type so yes I do use Superstar or Fab Paints I use tag I use Diamond Effects I use Snazaroo I use uh, Maron you know Paradise um, I use everything whatever uh, works for me because each one has different colors each one has a different consistency each one does their own thing so you can actually work them all together and make your art look even better I mean what is it Krylon makes some great colors that are great for bases but Diamond FX, Wolf FX and Tag make paints that are great for doing line work on top they're also great for bases but they're a little heavy and they're harder to blend um, just little things like that but yeah I'm going to be seeing about going over to the Netherlands so I gotta get my passport and everything and get my security check and blah 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 this and that through the government now but yes yeah, so I'm going to be going over to the Netherlands to visit uh, Eugenie over at Diamond FX and uh, hopefully I can also visit uh, Liliana Sepulveda and um, uh, Leafy and um, a whole bunch of the other ones maybe maybe I'll see about getting them all together and we'll really make one big old jam or a party together when I get over there but um, I'm going to be looking forward to that so really guys no tutorial today I just had a lot of information I wanted to give you um, uh, what else is there to say next year is going to be a really fun year okay I have a lot that I want to show I have a lot that I want to give and I want you guys to receive uh, without having all the harshness of this past year I'll be glad once the year's over with I can stop this blog I know you guys didn't like the ranting and raving that I did I know that you you know don't like some of the things I do but the thing is get over the hate of certain things get on get on to the love of the art because that's the main thing no matter what I am personally my art professionally um, speaks for itself so just because you don't like something I do doesn't mean you have to hate me you know I mean yeah I'm done but uh, thank you guys for watching uh, if you have any questions post them in the comments below or on Facebook okay um, just 
have fun. Happy painting. I know I've been putting that down a lot. I didn't even know that's uh, Marcella Mama Clown Marad's uh, <laughs> saying there. But I've been using it for a long time, so I guess it's my saying too. Happy painting, guys. Thanks for watching. Rate, comment, subscribe if you haven't. And uh, I'll look forward to seeing you in the next video. Hopefully I'll have a tutorial up in the next couple of days and stuff. I'll definitely have some photos up later. But um, no photos today. My friend wasn't able to make it last night. So unfortunately, uh, didn't get another organic piece out. But hopefully I'll get some out this weekend. Um, thanks, guys. Talk to you later. Bye.